Greetings. Thanks for using StreamingChurch.tv. Today we want to show you how you can designate a web host so that when that web host logs onto the chat platform, uh, it will have a little uh, designation that, that tells everybody they're the web host. It will be basically after their name. So uh, the reason for doing this is it's just kind of good. Number one, we recommend that you have a web host, uh, whatever you want to call it, a church online pastor, somebody that, that will greet people when they log on, somebody to monitor the chat, uh, somebody to answer questions, to pray with people. Uh, those kind of things are really good. And it's nice to have something that designates that person as, you know, the leader as the web host. So you log in as a streaming church TV administrator, go to your streaming management area. And then from there, you want to go to services admin and uh, scroll down here to web host. So when you click web host, uh, you can uh, designate different web hosts. Here are two people already designated, and you just add a new web host. Uh, and the key to this, too, would simply be make sure that you enter their name as it matches how they would enter the chat room. So if they enter the chat room as Bob, and uh, you don't put the correct spelling of Bob in there, <laughs> you know, it's not going to show up. So once you do that, you add that person as a chat host and uh, save it. And then when I log in as Phil Thompson, and again, it's just Phil Thompson with no spaces or nothing else, Phil Thompson the third or Reverend Phil Thompson, I'm not entering, I'm entering in as Phil Thompson. It will match up and then it will say when I go in the chat, it will desi designate me as a web host. And uh, that kind of helps people identify uh, who they might ask specific questions to. So if you have questions about that or anything else, it's support at streamingchurch.tv. That's the email. We'd love to hear from you.